And now, get ready for the conclusion of the KFC College Humor Office Prank Contest as we induct the winner into the Office Prank Hall of Fame. Office Pranks, the little seeds of mischief that grow big trees of laughter, the glue that keeps coworkers collaborating, the zesty spice in your life's lunch, the tango. You get the point. Pranks are great, but sometimes they transcend the expected and enter a new realm of trickery. It was a typical day at the office. Little did anyone know that titan of modern pranking, Mike Pizzullo, was about to strike. Stealthily swiping the lotion of a coworker who dreamed of a future in hand modeling, Mike made a little change with big results. As he went on around his daily hand care regime, Mike's target began to notice something was not Whoa. right. Something isn't right. Although Mike's co-worker knew trouble was afoot, or on hand, he couldn't understand. No matter how much he scrubbed his orange-tinged mitts, they didn't get any cleaner, just chapped from the hot water. So naturally, he applied more lotion, setting a perfectly self-sustaining prank cycle in motion. <laughs> Little did he know, his lotion was no longer just lotion. It was self-tanning lotion. Each time he applied it, he only increased the umber shades that no mere hand soap would remove. Once the prank had played its course, Mike took pity on old Syracuse Orange and revealed his prank to Carrot Fingers. Of course, by then the rest of the office had joined in the fun. But Mike Pizzullo is a prankster and a gentleman. And to show there were no hard feelings, a peace offering of lunch was purchased. Wow. And so we honor this prank and the man who pulled it, Mike Pizzullo. <laughs> <laughs>